right around noon here in Salt Lake City, Utah. It's a nice autumn day. You know, it might be a little wet outside, but we have some uh, summer sun left in, in the skies coming up over the next probably two to three, maybe four weeks. But yeah, we're obviously going uh, from autumn and gosh darn it, I guess winter has to come. Uh, I know all the skiers and snowboarder, snowboarders out there can't wait. Last year, 900 and I think 30 inches of snow. <laughs> that was insane. Uh, it was fun. I'll tell you, I, I do enjoy the sun and the fun and the pools and bikinis and, and wearing shorts and, and kicking back and barbecuing outside. But, but it is pretty funny to see 900 inches of snow. Uh, folks, divide that by 12 inches. It, it's a lot. All right. Well, anyway, if I'm live on Facebook, uh, hey, hey, hello. Hey, hello. All right. And if you're on my YouTube channel, thanks, guys, for supporting it and, you know, subscribing to it. Uh, normally, I talk a whole heck of a lot about Live Good, the company, the products, the opportunity, what I've been doing since March and the success I've been having and having people join my family, uh, the Live Good family. It's worldwide at this point. Um, I've got uh, 500 people just having a great time just in my little piece of this live good pie that has 760,000 people aboard in less than one year. So what a ride, what a ride. And it's funny was uh, when I see my computer screen, it looks like these guys are having fun at the beach. <laughs> that won't be the case today. Uh, the reason I'm going live real quick here is I'm going to be heading down to ABC channel four. Uh, it's our affiliate here. Uh, that's ABC. All right. Uh, you guys know all the TV stations. Um, I'm a big fan of ABC. And every year we go down there. Uh, this will be uh, year number five for Rock and Hot Rod Productions. Uh, this Saturday, October 14th, we're going to be producing the Toys for Tots Charity Car Show. All right. And this Saturday, let's see, it, it is the 14th and it, it kicks off around 10 a.m. People with their show cars and whatnot, they're, they're probably going to get there at 6, 7 o'clock, setting up canopies and chairs. This is a pretty big event, guys. We're going to have probably 300 and something vehicles there. So this Saturday, if you want to come to Rockin' Hot Rod's production of the Toys for Tots Charity Car Show, uh, bring some tennis shoes. Last year, I was tired. I got to admit, by the time it was 3, 4 o'clock, I could barely drag my butt out of there. Uh, there's a lot of cars, a lot of fun. Weather's going to be great. We have music cranking, of course. And we'll have food. I, I know we're going to have tacos there. So I'm done. If there's a taco truck, forget about it. But I, everybody enjoys food uh, from the trucks. All right? Big business now. Uh, you know, last year when I got there, there was like free coffee and donuts. And a lot of the guys from Channel 4, they brought so many desserts. And I'm going to try not to eat uh, more than 14 desserts while I'm there. So anyway, uh, this afternoon, uh, we're going to get there a little after 3, 3.30, and we're just going to set up a little bit, and uh, we'll go uh, sometime just after 4 o'clock. I don't know the exact time, but uh, I'm just going to go live and, and, and talk about the event. You know, all the cars, Chevelles, classics, sidecars, motorcycles, there's modern muscle, which is basically about 2005 muscle cars and older. For example, the Cudas, the Challengers, we all know about the Mustangs and, and the, the Camaros that have all kind of given rebirth to the heyday of muscle cars in the 60s, up until about 1970-something. But by about 1973, the muscle car era, it was kind of like, Ugh. all right, but we have the newer versions of modern muscle. And bring anything, guys. I mean, if you have a truck, even if it's bone stock and it's kind of rusty and it's your grandpa's and it's patinaed out, that's where the paint is just faded but somehow it's been baked by the sun for the last 60, 70, 80 years. And if it runs cool with a big block and a carburetor and it gets four miles to the gallon, sounds good to me. Because we have unrestored survivor vehicles. That's where basically, yeah, they're, they're bone stock other than probably tires, plugs, oil, you know, wear and tear items. Uh, we have categories where if you're 25 years or younger, you can win an award. That's always kind of cool. But... Uh, if you've been to any of our shows, they're always fun, music cranking. Of course, we have awards to give away for a lot of categories. But the main reason we're there is for the Toys for Tots charity campaign. Now, last year, we raised a lot of not only cash, but gifts, toys. All right? Because I think you got to agree, there is nothing 
funner for kids when it is Christmas Eve. And if they get up in the morning, and I think most families, maybe Christmas Eve, you have like a dinner, maybe some family, uh, watch a movie or something. Uh, and I know that sometimes Santa comes on Christmas Eve and meets the family and maybe they open one gift. But I think the big prize is they get up and usually parents are tired. It's like 530. Kids are excited. They want to run downstairs. And if there's some presents to unwrap, that is awesome. All right. And it's important. Uh, I had a great childhood. I've had great holidays and Christmas. Uh, it does mean a lot to me. And Toys for Tots is, it's, it's my favorite charity out of all the ones that I've been affiliated with or have produced or promoted over the last 40 years. I love Toys for Tots. I think if you look at the back wall of my studio right now, you can tell that I'm a big fan of toys, even as I grow this silver beard. Okay. So I just wanted to do a quick break real quick, uh, just to send this out to my YouTube channel and live on my Facebook feed that if you guys are out and about, and maybe drop by Channel 4 Studios if you'd like to come by. Um, you guys can Google it, all right? It's just in West Valley. Uh, I don't have the address on my screen right now, but just put ABC Channel 4 anytime after 3.30. You know, if you have a little hot rod, something cool, you know, just park in front. We're going to go outside, show some cars, and, and, and just promote. And then Friday morning, we're also going to be down there again. Uh, all right, with Rock and Hot Rod Productions, uh, with Blaine, Jill, myself, we're gonna have more hot rods and cars. I brought my Harley Davidson down last year. Uh, it's yellow, and coincidentally, I've got my yellow hat and or I mean my yellow hat's off to the side here, and, I'll, and my yellow shirt. So keeping yellow alive. But anyway, Friday morning, anytime after 8:30, we're gonna round up just a bunch of cars, park in front again. You know, if, if people want to bring coffee or donuts. Uh, the car show community is awesome. And in front of Channel 4, they have a nice area where you can park quite easily. And they have a big grass, kind of, uh, you can see the flags and grass in the middle. Okay, that's about the only place you can park in front of Channel 4. It's on the north side. All right, so when you Google the address, you drive literally, literally right up to the front of Channel 4. You can't miss where to park or hang out. Okay, so come say hi. We'll take some pictures. And Friday morning, uh, we'll also go on uh, the old boob tube, the television, and promote the event as well. And once again, it's Saturday. It is the Rockin' Hot Rods production of the Toys for Tots charity car show. All right, I can't wait. Uh, I just got my walking shoes on, and I'm going to eat. I forgot to eat breakfast and lunch last year. <laughs> so, man, if you saw me last year, I was like, God... I was so hungry, and man, my legs were worn out from all the cars and pictures and fun. So anyway, uh, this afternoon, I'm sure it'll be on the replay. And the way television is now, uh, th there's always a video that's uploaded on Channel 4. And if they have it, I'll probably put it on my feed here on either uh, Facebook or YouTube. So, all right, guys. Well, I'm feeling good. Hopefully, you're living good. And like I say, uh, this is my Live Good channel, but I just wanted to hurry and promote the uh, appearance on Channel 4 this afternoon, anytime after 3.30, but I think that the show that we're going to be on is 4 to 5, okay? And that's it. And you guys know Channel 4 if you live here in Utah, and if you're online, they do everything online as well. It is just ABC Studios, Channel 4, okay? Pretty easy, and I think I have their logo here. You, you know, if I had better, better organization, um, there it is right there. All right, so look for the logo here, just Channel 4 ABC. You can kind of see the Utah Capitol in the background, and that's a pretty snazzy logo. You guys can uh, find that quite easily if you do a Google search. So, all right, that's going to do it for me. All right, I got some video that I need to promote for the Mighty Live Good before I take off here. And you guys have a good afternoon, okay? All right, talk to you later. Bye.